Did I just make that up? Uh, I made it up? Oh, he was here. Just nobody came. Oh, shit. Shit. Oh, goodness. Uh, guys, this is one of the last shows I'm going to be doing before I'm no longer your current reigning RuPaul's Drag Race Superstar. So what, what a great crowd to hang out with. And who is going to take over my throne? James Bond Is it Alyssa Edwards? No. Or what's her name? Roxy Andrews. That's her name. <laughs> or will it be Heidi Alaska not have drugs in it, so just keep that. Dollar looks bold and very inconspicuous. Yeah, but, yeah. <laughs> Remember that fucking weed we got in Amsterdam? Oh my god. I know, I love free drugs. They're like drugs that you pay for, except you still have the same amount of money. Tweeted me. Isn't that a beautiful drawing? Yeah. That's I get the most beautiful fan art. Whoever threw it, who threw it? Thank you so much. Didn't I tweet you? Yeah, wasn't that fun? Yeah. I wish a fucking star would tweet me. I can't even get a virus send me a tweet. Sorry about it. I stole her job. How's it going, Jack? You doing good? What? You want my drugs? Oh, no, it's just a shtick. I don't really do drugs. <laughs> you don't ride a track queen that doesn't do drugs. I don't trust him. That is why me and Fifi became such good friends again, because she's got the best glow. That's why she gets so upset all the time. Did I lose another eyebrow, Spike? That was embarrassing. All right, I'm gonna do one more song, and it's not, it's not a party track, it's not a party track. We're gonna check it down a little bit a notch, but this song's really important to me, and so it's, it's really dedicated to uh, my closest fans who really like to decorate their bodies and tell the world exactly how they feel and may or may not have been persecuted because of it. Um, and uh, you guys are my real, the, the visual terrorists in this audience are my fucking heroes. Because the only terror you ever created was expressing yourself and you had to absorb the real fucking hatred of this world. So keep on terrorizing them. Terror darling! As a queer community, we should no longer be tucking in our shirts, decorating wedding cakes, and saying, Hi, fabulous! We need to be fucking monsters. Fucking terrorists. And I'm not talking little monsters. I'm talking huge ones. If we're not going to get the rights we deserve, let's scare the shit out of them. Or as Moon Baby would say, sorry about it. Okay, guys, this one's for you. Hit it, Jack.
someone who is over the brink Well, I dress this way just to keep them at bay Cause Halloween is every day Why can't I live a life for me? Why should I?